Hi guys and girls, James Morrison, James Social Cycling. How are we doing? Sorry guys, I'm naked, only nine miles in, but still not feeling it. But I had to come out, it's lovely. I'm overdressed, I'm just a bit worried when the when the sun goes down but it doesn't look like it's going to go down in my ride due to the fact that I come out just after half five what is it now? it's gone six so all okay oh, sorry guys, it's a bit knackered the weekend was a funny one it was cold and now Bike's still making a noise. It's a bit of a, a bit of a demotivator to be fair. Bike making noise. Evening traffic. And then there's a car back. No. No car back. No alive. Car back. Let's get him over my shoulder. So yeah, so a good weekend on the bike for the flab ride, social ride, which was cool. Just about to start up, well I've started. Sunday and Monday, James Social Cycling, social ride group. Um, not so much of the constraints of flab, more, oh this is that hill. <laughs> it snuck up on me. It's not very high, it's not steep my legs today I'm just done in let's get into a nice easy gear spin it out so I'm looking at doing 29 miles actually even though I am knackered so it's Monday evening on my way to Odium so I'm slowing down that's what happened happens when you just haven't got it Everything's a bit of a struggle. Everything's a grind, man. And I hate the fact that my bike makes a noise. It's demotivating. Just want it to be quiet. Anyway, maybe that's a lesson I need to learn. On my way to Odium, 24 or 29 mile route. I'm probably going to do 29. Because did no miles last week, did 46 over the weekend, 47, did pretty poor to be fair, sorry, looking for a car, I'm overdressed tonight, but I'm out on the bike, I've got to look at that, out on the bike, coming up to a mainish road, so I'll uh, catch up with you. Yay! I've got some good evidence. There's a noise. Guys, I'm going to have to put you back in my pocket because we've got, well, we've got a bit of a climb and the reward is seeing Basingstoke. So you can probably agree. I'm uh, looking forward to that. That's good. nice views there made it to the top and as I said look you get the lovely views of Basingstoke it's beautiful that's a good view look at that that's got to be 35 mile an hour all the way down it's not too bad looks quite misty looks all right look that way's nice look pheasant and his harem what does that remind you of <laughs> hope you're all well people so 
So I've got some good evidence. So it's not evidence, it's just that the guys can't make it noisy. So at least now I've got some good feedback from the bike. I bet it's my cleat. <laughs> I've got some new pedals coming so they can they can warrant that one out of it. I've gone for some Shimano 105s. I looked at the Ultegras and they were like 265 weight. And you know I'm not a weight weenie, but at 90 quid, it was 90 quid, 89 quid. It was 90 quid. I think they were going for 90 quid with some cleats. But the 105s were one that were 248. Evening, guys. For 248. And I just thought to myself, well, I'm no weight weenie because look at me. Look at me. I'm no weight weenie. So uh, he was nice and friendly. Another vlogger, he says. He's not a cyclist. So yeah, so I've got those coming, so we can hopefully do away with that. Look, I've got a friend. Hopefully we can do away with that. Um, so yeah, get put new cleats in there and get rid of that, hopefully. And it won't be even the noise, so that'd be cool. But yeah, I'm just annoyed with the noise since spending 300 quid. Shh, it's not 300 quid. Nowhere near 300 quid, but it all needed renewing. It's the problem. 300 bloody quid later, and I got an annoying noise. Busy now. Busy now. I'm overdressed, people. It is. I, I can't wait for the sun to go down because I am overdressed. It's quite warm the first 11 miles to Odium. But since this is going down, and that's probably what, no, I'm not even gonna talk about it. I'm not even gonna talk about it. What am I? 13.6 miles in. Got that lovely view, it's not too bad. I could pretend it's somewhere in France or even Italy, look, look. Hey, Italy, let's pretend it's Italy. It could be Italy. Anyway, right, I'm gonna, it on my rear light my rear light is low four bloody percent it said it wasn't that see sense for you can be a bit of a pain um, so but I've got a front light I brought you can see there you are, I've brought I brought my 16,000 lumens so I could put the white light my uh, see sense front light on the back if need be, but I think I've got enough sun. I've only got, uh, what we got? So 16 miles. So uh, I'll try and check into you again. If not, not a problem. I'll uh, see you when I get home. All right, peeps. 21 miles in. 21 miles in. Why, why have I stopped? I don't even know if you can see me. To be fair, let's have a look. So I've decided to pull over and check my cleats on this shoe because I will catch up with you maybe when I get back all right it is still Monday evening but I wanted to do um, I wanted to sort of get my cycling to lose weight series going 
so um, for Thursday so hopefully I can get this uploaded Thursday um, with just a little bit of a chat and, and a weigh in so I'll show you the weigh in I had which was two weeks ago now two weeks ago which I was still the same weight I don't know how I did it but it was in 111.2 same weight as I was just before I went away to Germany and uh, yeah was it was good um, but then I was going to obviously do a video and as I said it was it wasn't like I couldn't upload the video I couldn't up, I couldn't download the video from the card from the GoPro so um, because it was about 18 it was about 19 20 minutes long Yeah, it was about 19 20 minutes long um, and for some reason it just wouldn't up, wouldn't doubt wouldn't I couldn't get it to transfer so I was a bit gutted about that because I obviously wanted to talk to you about the fact that I'm still not on a diet and to be fair I'm gonna weigh myself Thursday morning and um, I've been feeling like crap and I know why I've been eating I've been eating I haven't been eating shite but I've been eating a lot of healthier, unhealthy options, if you can know what I mean. Um, I, d I don't know, I just, all over the weekend I just ate, I just wanted to eat. Sorry, I'm, I don't mean to keep looking away, but, um, so my eating rubbish in between meals as caused me and lunch actually I've been eating a bit of bread a bit of sand, having sandwiches some toast snacking toast uh, jam on toast jam sandwich I remember having it's just you know London I was quite good it was, it was a few mishaps because what else can you do but I come back and the weekend it's just awful so and I felt like crap all weekend second half of this ride would have been a much better if that bloody noise weren't happening and some guy actually was quite nice a guy uh, you know one of those wafer thin cyclists past me uh, well actually he didn't pass me he come up beside me and we had a chat so it was quite nice of him I appreciate that because usually guys just overtake you they don't give you a time or day which you know maybe that's one for grind my gears but it was really nice of him to stop by he, was a pedal on customer because he was riding a lovely lovely little giant TCR um, so yeah so that was quite nice and and he had to go but every time I push it was a bloody nightmare so the legs sort of come back they've, sort of, they've kind of come back which is good which is very good to be honest um, so you know there's a lot to be said and I know I've said this in another video a lot to be bloody said for you are what you eat you know and and that's exactly what's been wrong with me this weekend yeah it's because of what I've been eating I've been eating and don't get me wrong all right no do get me wrong actually do get me wrong because I I know I polished off um, oh, I've just eaten them. the wrong crap I come back I come back from uh, Wellington with a couple of bars of chocolate and they were four ninety nine each so they were bloody nice chocolate um, yeah and said right they, they've got to last you four days <laughs> four days oh mate oh smashed them within two but they were really nice well one of them had nuts in so and that's the problem as well but eating these Brazil chocolate I've, I've again I've said this to you before Brazil chocolate, you know, oh they are lovely, they are, they're absolutely gorgeous and and you are, you know, you're getting a lot of goodness out of the Brazils but yeah, a 200 gram packet of that has got to be 120 grams of, of carbs and it's not good carb is it? Um, so, so I really need to get back on my game really need to get back on my game the last six weeks you know i lost a stone and a half within probably a couple of months maybe i could have probably i'd be down to my weight now and those hills in <laughs> and the candovers 
would have, wouldn't have been so hard going um, yeah so you know sorry guys this is pretty raw right you know I, I, I have mucked up over the weeks you know I had a good excuse when I was a week in Germany a massively massive excuse when I was in Germany it was brilliant you know I, but I was quite good in Germany I drank a bit but I still come back I put on a little bit and got rid of it but no I'm a nightmare it's been a nightmare I, you know a complete nightmare even the cafe stops you know latte and a bit of cake it's a banana cake, a bit of banana cake on Sunday, and I just ugh. anyway. Hopefully, I'll come back to you. This is Monday evening. I'll use this, I've got to use this because I've got to be honest with you. I've got to be honest with my bloody self, not you, myself. So, hopefully, within the next couple of days, I can sort of turn things around, just get back on it. Um, we'll see, we'll see. Anyway, I'm outside, as you can see, house 28. I'm um been sneaky and downloading a video from the weekend I couldn't make it down here earlier today so uh, that's why I keep coming over here I could be 100 kilograms right now instead of 111 or a bit more than that at the moment I don't know I haven't weighed myself I feel good I still feel good you know you'll see in the last video actually you, uh, oh no I didn't use it but Molly took a bit of a video of me and I thought actually I've lost I have lost a bit of weight which is great going but you know, I could do it a lot healthier. I could do it a lot healthier. <coughs> anyway, so um, you see my weigh-in. I'll do a weigh-in on Thursday, and hopefully I'll just add a bit of comment. Um, this is a bit raw as usual. I'm still okay in the head. Usually, usually that does your head in, and and I think you see by the video from the weekend. I couldn't be bothered to go riding anywhere after after the social rides and you know I've been out in the bloody cold before but I just could not be bothered I couldn't be bothered it was just an absolute mare I just couldn't be bothered and that's the reason it wasn't the cold it was just I just wanted to go and sit on my sofa and do bugger all so anyway I will come back to you um, and hopefully get this uploaded for Thursday evening. I'll have to come here for a coffee, I think. Um, yeah, um, we've got some rides booked. I've actually got a ride, as, I, as you see in my last video, so I've got Allsford on Friday, Saturday, Sunday, and Monday. I'm starting up my um, James Social Cycling Social Rides. Um, so that will go on to Cycling UK in the next week or so, so I'll have a group on there. Um, which is good so I'll be fully insured and any any of my leaders any of the other guys that are with me they'll be able to help out as well so all good stuff I'd say
babes, it is now Thursday. Um, yes, so weigh in this morning. Um, it's no excuse. I was point, as you see, I put it in now. So, 111.6, so I'm point four up from my last weigh in two weeks ago. Yes, it's not a, not an excuse. Let me uh, let me know how to work this. It's not an excuse. Um, I'm actually not being not feeling too good in the throat today. So um, again, another thing that shows you know that um, been eating rubbish. So uh, even if it is healthy rubbish, the healthier rubbish option. Um, I'm not feeling a bit of a, a bit of a cold coming on. So. Um, which is my own fault, so lesson learned. Hopefully, hopefully, um, I can still go out on the bike this weekend. Um, as you can see as well, just an update, uh, the Ruby is at the LBS. Um, they couldn't fit, well, they've got her today. If they can fit her in today, they will, but if not, it's Saturday morning. So they are changing over the BB, the bottom bracket. Um, hopefully, what else can it? What else can it be? So, hopefully, they'll um, sort that knocking out, as you heard. Apologies, apologies. I like the tune, so apologies if it went on a bit on the road. Although I did show the bit of noise, um, and yeah, and I just like the tune. So hopefully, you can chill out and relax to that as well. Excuse my rawness. Um, it is what it is. I have to kick my backside and uh, get things sorted um, but yeah everything's great I'm off out today I'm off to work so I just thought I'd put this together quickly for you and later on this afternoon hopefully I can get this uploaded and um, yeah happy Easter everybody I said happy Easter happy Easter have a great weekend um, and hopefully I will be bringing you some footage from the weekend. There's no big mahoosive rides except for Sunday. I've got uh, Sunday and Monday. Actually, I've got social rides Saturday, Sunday and Monday. Um, Friday's off now because I've only got the mountain bike. So I'm not doing any mammoth uh, 50 plus miles on that poor thing uh, with heels anyway. So, um, yes. So thank you very much, everybody. Big up to my subscribers. If you're not subscribed, subscribe. Give us a like. Um, next video, I will do my 100 subscriber giveaway. All right, so look out for that. Be a bit of a short video, just um, sort something out. And um, yeah, fantastic. Appreciate all your support, everybody. And I will see you on the road very soon.